February 19th, 2008 from New York. Hi, I'm Shelley Palmer. First up, Nielsen says that 13 million homes are unprepared for the end of analog television, and another 6 million households have at least one TV set that will be affected. The company believes that Hispanic viewers will be especially hard hit because they have the highest rate of antenna-only viewers. Also, certain markets have a much higher percentage of antenna-only viewers, including Portland, Oregon, Los Angeles, St. Louis, and Albuquerque. These markets will be amongst the worst affected by the transition. What transition? Why, it's the end of analog television, February 17, 2009. You can get the details at ShellyPalmerMedia.com. Apple has signed a deal with American Idol, making iTunes the exclusive seller of Idol downloads. iTunes will also sponsor show streams on the Idol site, and iPods will become the official music players for the series. iPhones will also be used as the official mobile phones for the show. Yes, it's all very official. I wonder what the Hulu people are thinking about this. In related news, iTunes will begin selling a limited number of BBC shows. iTunes, the seventh network. Hmm... Verizon has seen such high demand for its Fios TV service that Motorola is unable to keep up with the demand for HD set-top boxes and HD DVRs. Verizon saw a spike in demand for Fios during the holidays, leaving Motorola scrambling to fulfill orders. What's the benefit of Fios? Well, it's a better television experience and the internet connectivity smokes the competition. Comcast and Motorola are developing a cost-effective turnkey solution for small cable operators that will allow them to go all digital and begin offering VOD, gaming, and other advanced services. The companies will outline their plans this week at National Cable Television's Winter Educational Conference in Phoenix. And since official seems to be our official word of the day, as we reported yesterday, Toshiba has officially announced that it will stop producing and marketing HD DVD players. Shipments to retailers will cease by the end of March. The company said it simply had no chance to win and that continuing the format would harm consumers. And that's Media Bytes for February 19th, 2008. Remember, each day I sort through all the technology, media, and entertainment news so you don't have to. Visit ShellyPalmerMedia.com, give us two minutes, and we'll give you stuff you really care about. For Media Bytes, I'm Shelly Palmer. See you tomorrow.